Assalam o Alaikum students hope you all are doing good this is your Islam at Yonard and I am your teacher Miss Amreen today we will continue with the chapter of ethics Allah does not like liars so we should be careful that whatever we speak is true a Muslim should always speak the truth telling the truth is a very good habit if you always speak the truth, you save yourself from a lot of trouble. You will also be a good person whom Allah loves. If Allah is pleased with us, He will reward us with heaven. The Holy Prophet peace be upon him said, Truth is good, it leads to heaven. Falsehood is wickedness, it leads to hell. If we tell lies, no one will believe us even if we speak the truth. Have you heard the story of the shepherd boy and the wolf? It has a lesson to teach us. Once a boy lived in a village. Every day he used to take the sheep and God's belongings to his family to graze. One day he said to himself, I must do something for fun. I will cry, wolf, wolf. The people will think that a wolf has come to eat the sheep and goats and they will come to help them. When they find out that there is no wolf, I will enjoy myself. So he did it. When the people came to help him, he told them that he was only joking. He did it twice. Then one day, a wolf did come. Help, help, the wolf, the wolf, cried the boy. This time, the boy was not joking. He was telling the truth, but nobody paid attention to what he said. No one came to help him. The wolf ate all up his animals. People did not believe him because he was in the habit of telling lies. In this way, the boy was punished for telling lies. A truthful person is loved and respected by the people. Everyone hates a person who tells lies. You should always try to speak the truth. It is bad manners to enter someone's house without permission. Islam tells us to ask permission before entering someone's house, even if they are your relatives or close friends. When you go to visit someone, you should knock at the door three times. If no one answers, then you should go back. You should thank people when they help you or give you something. About thanking people, the Holy Prophet peace be upon him said, He who does not thank people does not thank Allah. We all make mistakes, but when you realize that you have made a mistake, you should say sorry. Hope you all have understood. Now coming towards the assignment. Today's assignment is question number one. Why should we respect our teachers? Question number two. Why should we always speak the truth? Question number three. How was the shepherd boy punished for telling lies? Do the given assignment in your exercise book. Make sure your work should be neat and clean. Have a nice day.